what up my peeps how's it going today we're gonna be looking at how to get yourself a griffin mount and this is not gonna be a walkthrough to how to get the specific achievements so I'm gonna leave a link down below so I'm gonna be talking about the requisites how to get to the griffin ranch and what you need to do the griffin and unlock it so thank you very much for watching and I'll see you soon So in order to get your mount, you're going to start at the Vatendi Academy Waypoint. Work your way around straight, east, towards that waypoint over there, the viewpoint I mean. And pretty much behind it, as soon as you go over the cliff, you'll see somewhere around here, you're going to see the, the Griffin Ranch. So that's basically where you get your Griffin. So, I'll show you the way right now. You basically want to get your skimmer out for this area. And then you're going to just go through because the skimmer doesn't get hit by lightning. Straight on east from the, the waypoint. Try and avoid all the enemies. So at this point you just jump downwards. Try and find a, a safe space. A safe place. So what we've done here, so what we've done here is basically go uh, from the Vitendi uh, Academy straight east to that bubble, and then now we're gonna go over this hill over here. So grab your bunny, your Springer, and we're on the go. So with the Springer, we're gonna just jump over here, just jump over this uh, big hill over here. Once you're at this um, this point of interest, you can just jump up here. Keep on jumping through. Basically, you're just trying to get as high as you can because this hill is between you and your Griffin. You gotta get through. So yeah, once you're up to the top, um, you can see right there. That's the Griffin Ranch. That altar over there. So you can just go ahead and jump down onto it, or glide over. And uh, once you get there, basically you talk to that dude in the middle, you see over there. And uh, yeah, he'll give you an item that you can just uh, teleport into here, so that's not going to be an issue coming here. And yeah, that will start off your, your missions and your open skies achievement. Then basically you need to, uh, to complete five achievements. That's the first stage, and this is the part where it c it's going to cost you 250 gold total, um, so 25 gold at a time. Uh, so if you go to rare collections here, you can see the five different achievements you're going to need. It's going to be open skies, crystal oasis. It's going to be um, basically one for each region. So desert highlands, there's Vabi, there's um, riverlands, and desolation as well. And each one of these you're gonna do basically the same thing or the same type of thing but in each of the maps so um, if we have a look at it at one of these for example here in open skies crystal oasis you need to pick up nine items one of them you pick up from completing an event two of them you complete yellow hearts and then buy from the vendor an item worth 25 gold each that's where you spend all your money and then the five eggs per map as well so after completing each one of those achievements for every map uh, of the new expansion, you're gonna come back here and you can use the item as I said before to just come here. You're gonna place all these items around the circle here and then place every egg in the griffin's nest. So once you're completed with this, you're basically gonna finish this achievement and you're gonna get a new achievement which is discover the dark library and you get this new item that you can then use to open up a portal so what you need to do after this is so in order to do this you need to go back to learn our crawl waypoint and make your way to the tomb of the primeval kings
So once you make it there, just open up the portal. And you go on to the library. So inside the library you're going to see veterans going about with keys. And you're going to need to pick up 10 keys in order to pick up 10 uh, wisdom chests. And yeah, you're basically going to go about, you're going to see different types of monsters. And you will see chests about, yeah, you're going to need keys to open those chests. And as you see, all the veterans have keys. The other normal creatures do not have keys. But yeah, once you finish up this uh, dark library, I recommend you take a friend to do it. But once you finish up this achievement, you go back to the spear marshal dude. And yeah, you can start the last bit of this, which is basically a boss fight. It's quite a chill boss fight, I must say. Um, so... Just go ahead and do it alone. I don't think you can even take a friend. Uh, so, yeah, have fun. I hope you enjoyed this uh, sort of tutorial walkthrough on how to get started and how it's going to progress through your... while well, you're trying to unlock your Griffin Mount. And I hope it was useful. Well, don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And drop down in the comments down below your thoughts. And don't forget to uh, like the video as well as share it with some friends of yours that might be wanting to unlock the Griffin Mount. In any case, thanks very much for watching. I'm going to leave you with this boss fight. Good luck with unlocking your Griffin Mount, because it's quite an adventure. And I'll see you next time. Once you finish the boss fight, you're gonna unlock your griffin, and that's your uh, griffin unlocked just like all the other mounts, and you're gonna have all these masteries associated with them. They work exactly the same way as your other mounts' masteries. Hope you enjoyed this video, thanks very much for watching. Enjoy your griffin mount, it's quite expensive and had a lot of work, but it is a lot of fun. And thanks very much for watching, don't forget to subscribe, like this video if you enjoyed it, comment down below what you thought of it, if you have any criticism, and what you'd like to see in the future of this channel as well. Uh, thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you next time.